on everybody bear ghost here and welcome to another video and today i want to start off by thanking a buddy of mine akiran he's in my police files apb videos um for introducing game globe to me uh earlier this uh, this afternoon or evening um he knows that i've got a wide variety of different age groups of people who uh, watch my channel and he thought this would be a very very good uh browser type game for me to check out for you know my mid to younger audiences and you guys know that I I'm a variety gamer I play games for all ages and I wanted to show you guys this if you haven't checked it out already so basically if you head on over to gameglobe.com it brings you up to this website all you've got to do is create yourself an account which is very simple you put in your email password um, username boom you create an account that's all there is to it and I'll put a link in the description for gameglobe.com so basically you've got um, think of it as like Roblox in the essence that it's got tons of user you know user based and created levels for you to play ranging from racings to uh, action RPGs to just t mini games everything there's just tons and tons and tons and pages of user created games by people I mean there's just pages of them so basically um, I'll show you one of them that I've already played that's actually just to kinda of give you guys a glimpse of what Game Globe is about so basically as the game is loading it kinda of shows you a little bit of the controls here this one's called the Suburban Barbecue the neighborhood has been oddly silent the past few weeks Rumors of mysterious disappearances are whispered across the hedges. The remaining inhabitants are having a nice barbecue this evening to lift spirits. You better go keep an eye on things. And like I said, these are all user created levels. So everything, every game you're going to play is going to be completely different objectives, everything. So here we are in the game. We got a little beta t-shirt on since we're playing the beta. You can actually customize your character. You get enough experience and coins from playing these games. You can customize your, your little avatar guy. And these little experience balls you're seeing kind of help guide you towards your objective so that way you don't get lost. Barbecue move to neighbor's house. Find the key at the back of the red house. And it kind of gives you little cutscenes to kind of show you where you need to go next. There's the key. There you go. And it shows it points you in the direction you gotta go. Hey miss, where'd she go? Wasn't she just right here? Yeah, that's kind of a thorny looking bush. You walk into that and get stabbed in the face. There's the key. Oh. Well here we go. Okay then, I guess we're going to go ahead and head over this way, back here, oh, there's that lady, hey miss, I think she's having a bad hair day, oh, there's a shovel, now we're going to slap her and beat her face in, there we go, collect your little experience balls everywhere, oh, can we play with the blocks? No, I guess we can't. Whoa. I guess that must be your husband. Back up. There's the barbecue. You're finally here. Something odd is going on. The bushes. Protect the neighbors, okay? I think I can accomplish that. Neighbor, a car is coming. I think I can even speed up my... Let's change it to high. There we go, a little bit faster of a mouse. There's some controls if you hit escape. You can go to your controls as well. Ooh. Oh, wait, wait, nope, nope, back it. Get away from him. Get away. Get away from my neighbors. Get back. Get away, get away, get away. 
Nope, don't think so. Get away. Back up. Back up. Get to the car now. Ooh, I'm grabbing all my experience. There are more coming from the bushes. Open the gates. Yeah, please open the gates. We need to escape the situation. Quickly. Alright, gates are open. Everybody needs to get out. We've got a drive to the tunnel at the bottom of Three Flags Hill. I guess we're gonna drive in this thing. Here we go. This big old tank thing. Oh, we got a zombie in the road, and over he goes. <laughs> speed bump! Oh, here's another speed bump. Uh-oh, low fuel. This thing didn't come with very much fuel in it. Oh, big guy. <laughs> fuel left. Oh, wow. We're running out of fuel already. Oh, it's got some cool rock music going. Guess I should pay attention to where I'm driving. <laughs> Instead of rocking out. Objective completed. Drive to tunnel. But the tunnel is blocked. There is another way! That way through the electrical field. There is a sewer entrance next to the electrical substation. New objective. Locate the sewers. Roger that. Oh, probably shouldn't walk across that. Let's go around it. That's probably the safer way to go. Hey, look, there's our experience balls. Objective completed. Locate the sewers. The electrical fence is on. Captain Obvious here. Find a way through the electrical fence into the sewers. Back up. I see experience balls back over here. Wow, that guy's got a lot of health. Oh, crap. Okay, let's come up on this thing. Let's see if we can jump up here. What do we got up here? Oh, we got a spike bat looking thing. Back up, back up. All these experience balls everywhere. Like everywhere. Oh, there we go. Oh boy. I'm gonna collect all these. Back up. I'm gonna run through here. There's a lot of zombies around here. I'm just gonna. Uh oh. Sewer entrance. Oh, here we go. Electric substation. Oh, that's kind of creepy. <laughs> Power on and off. Okay. Power's off. Oh, I guess we gotta go up the ladder. Climb the ladder, quickly, boy. Um, do we jump down there? Oh, back up. Man, this little spike bat does some damage on people. Sewers. Sewers it is. Find a way through the electricity fence into the sewers. Objective completed. Now we're in the creepy sewers. Dun dun dun! To be continued. Level completed. There you guys go. So, like I said, you can play all these cool different games and kind of go through them, complete the levels. 
There's tons of them, and then you can write comments down here if you liked it. You can click a thumbs up, add it to your favorites if you want to keep playing it. Um, like I said, there's all sorts of different things you can play. You've got like these adventure ones. We'll do one more for you guys really quick. We'll just play the next one that's in line here, just to try it out. The little forest cottage. Once upon a time, in a faraway forest, you had a little cottage. But now, the years have passed, and the place is overgrown. Can you still find your way back? <laughs> no. Probably not. Without these little magical balls, I do not know where to go. The bridge is broken. Oh. But there is another way around. I'm glad these magical balls are showing me which way to go. Oh, through the bushes. Whoa. That scared me. Yeah, this is like a really long fall. Oh, that was close. I'm a little nervous here. Side scroller action. Oh. Thought I hit my head on something. What is this lever? Ah, oh, sweet. Brought down a little ladder for us here. Whoa. Oh, those are the checkpoints that keep making those noises. Someone should give that big old tree a push. You mean this one? Oh, you mean this one? Perfect landing. I shall... Whoa. Yeah, that's a little nerve-wracking there. Oh my! The gate is completely overgrown! Well, where's my hedge clippers? That's what I'm needing is some hedge clippers. That would be really good to have right about now. Oh crap, the bridges are breaking. Jeez. The water is everywhere. Oh, there is water everywhere. The cottage is flo- oh, the cottage is underneath. Drain the valley of water. Okay. Hmm. How can we drain the... Ah, wait a minute. The drain lever is broken. Of course it is. There must be another way to get the drain gate to open. It was showing something up there near those, near those rose bushes. So let's go swimming over there. Let's go see if that's where we're needing to go. Right up here is where it looked like it was showing us. Okay, I see a boulder. We can push the boulder. Okay, the boulder fell in the water. Looks like it's draining. Okay. We're gonna walk through the garden here, collect all of our experience balls, or experience orbs. Finally! You found the way back. And you lived happily ever after. There you go, level completed. I've reached level two, collect your reward. Sweet! So there you guys go. There's a couple of demonstrations for you on a couple of the games that you guys can look forward to. If you guys are interested in playing, like I said, I'll put a link, or you can just simply go to GameGlobe.com. There's a lot of really cool games on here. I think you guys will have a lot of fun with it. It's definitely worth checking out. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and hopefully we'll see you in, a, in maybe in another couple games if you guys are interested. Let me know. Leave a like if, if you want to show your support, and if you guys want to see a couple more games played. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Maybe we'll see you next time.